Good morning. Today is Tuesday, January 10th. Our names are Melanie and Maria. And this is Philo today. today. Today's schedule is 513. Now please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you and now for a moment of silence. You may be seated. Citizenship Pride Club meeting tomorrow. If interested in joining SWAT, please speak to Mrs. Strato. Filer Scholars meeting Thursday. Any student interested in purchasing a yearbook can stop by the main office to pay for it. Students, please remember to order by your school sweaters in the PTA store. Boys basketball tryouts to start today. Tyrol Borrego, Nazan Vieira, Darlene Cesa, and William Queseda scored the most points on Christmas break compared to all students at Henry H. Filer Middle School. Bilingual using Team Biz. They earned 25 bonus points. Thank you, Ms. Oyoa. Yes, Chef! The after school cooking program sponsored by Mr. Bubel will continue today after school. Anyone interested in learning or trying out for golf? The only sport where boys and girls compete against each other. Please sign up in room 57. Practices will begin January 16th. If you are currently on another sports team, let me know because I can work around the schedule. Mr. Bubel. And now to sports. Last, that, last night, the University of Alabama and Clemson University competed in the college football championship in Tampa. Oh, Nelly, it was a game that lived up to the hype. The Clemson Tigers had a miraculous fourth quarter comeback, scoring three touchdowns in the fourth quarter. The last with one second remaining in the game to revenge its loss to the same opponent in last year's championship, 35-31. to And now to weather. Today's weather is 72 degrees with a 20% chance of rain and it's going to be partly cloudy. And now to lunch. Today's lunch is chicken wings, hamburgers, pasta alfredo, calzones, ham and cheese sandwiches, nacho bites, pork sandwiches, tuna, chef salad, veggie wrap, veggie burgers, waffle fries, baked beans, salad, peaches, juice and milk, and fresh fruit. And now to joke with the day. There was once a guy named Olaf who was mean, rude, and crude. One day, his wife and her friend were in the kitchen discussing Christmas. Suddenly, Olaf shouted, It's going to rain any moment now. The next thing you hear, it starts raining. The wife's friend is shocked. She says, How in the world did he know that? Without missing a beat, the wife said to her, Rude Olaf the Red knows reindeer. And now, to this day in history. On, on January 10th, 1920, the League of Nations formally comes into being when the Covenant of the League of Nations, ratified by 42 nations in 1919, it takes effect. In 1946, the League of Nations was officially dissolved with the establishment of the United Nations. The United Nations was modeled after the former but increased international support and extensive machinery to help the new body avoid repeating the League's failures. And now to daily. Students, please remember the school-wide behavior expectations. Be resourceful, ready, responsible, respectful, and healthy. Thank you. This has been Fido today.